All right, in this video, I want to create a rotation of an object about a point. So we'll click Start Creating and choose Geometry. We'll wait for that to open our work surface. I want to turn on my axes and my grid. Turn on the Algebra view. Close that keyboard. And here I want to, in that gear menu, set my distances to one. In the reflections in GeoGebra video, I explain how to do all that in a little more detail. Move everything to the center and zoom out a bit. All right, so first thing we need in order to do a rotation is a polygon that's going to be rotated. Here you type in any of the points that you're given for your particular polygon. I'm just going to make some up doesn't really matter which points I use. It's just an example. Let's do four, five. Okay. Create the polygon. Use that polygon tool. One, two, three. Okay, so there's our polygon. The next thing that we need is the point of rotation. Remember that's the fixed point in the rotation where everything's going to spin around it. So choose my point tool. I could also type the coordinates in over here at the left side. And we are going to rotate about the point negative 2, 1. Okay, so you have your polygon and you have your point of rotation. Back up here in our rotations or transformations menu, got rotate around a point. So we're going to choose that. And here at the bottom it says select object to rotate, then the center point and an angle. So choose the polygon, click in its interior, click on the point that you want to rotate about. And this box pops up that asks you, first of all, which direction do you want to rotate, clockwise or counterclockwise, and how many degrees do you want to rotate? In this case, I want to do a 90 degree rotation counterclockwise. And we can see then that the polygon is now rotated about point D, 90 degrees, and we can see here from A to D, and D to A prime, that's where that right angle is present. So we get a 90 degrees counterclockwise rotation about D. And there again, your coordinates of A prime, B prime, and C prime are over here at the left. And that's how we take care of a rotation. 